I know that you two couldn't be more perfect for each other. You two love each other, respect each other, and support each other in every, with everything that you have. Um, and that's one of the most important things in a marriage. So, <laughs> Joel, getting to know you over the past few weeks, um, I know that you're the husband, the best friend, and the biggest supporter that Lindsay's dreamed of her entire life. And I know that your genuine, calm nature will complement her stubbornness and strong <laughs> <of destiny>. <laughs> <laughs> That's so true. Lindsay, I, I didn't hear what you said. Watching you grow into the most Your gentleness and calmness really will um, basically like help her get through her stubbornness. And I'm honored to sit by your side today. <laughs> okay, so that everybody will just join me and raise your glass. My baby. Mom's having a baby. Woo! Are you? He's super excited. Did Daddy Yay. take it too? Are you so excited? You told him yes? Yeah! How about that right end? <laughs> I guess that's what I call it since then. Uh, for those of you that don't know me, uh, I don't actually talk to you. Uh, I'm Chris. Uh, for all of those who Joel's don't brother. know me, I'm the man. <laughs> uh, you know, as I once told uh, Waitress Mars uh, at breakfast, uh, we've been dating since high school, so it's been a while. But, uh, it's been a long time. Uh, you know, we've known each other 26 years. You add that up. Until it's 26, so you can do the math. Uh, you know, we, we've known each other for a while. So, uh, you know, it's hard to let my best friend go. He's my main homie. Uh, you know, we've been through everything together. Obviously, near death experiences multiple times. Uh, you know, on road, off road, it doesn't matter. It just happens. Near death, uh, it's also happening. But, uh, you know, we've been through cuts together, bulks together. Some of us stayed on those bulks longer than others. Um, but, but the funny thing is, you know, as I've joked about Joel, you know, I've never once, you know, said the F word. You know, we don't use the word fat. Uh, <laughs> we use the word Y, uh, specifically double Y. Uh, but, but I've never once used the F word. Because he's my main homie, I respect for him as he does the same. They probably uh, call each other that. Uh, fluffy, awesome. Uh, but double white for sure. Um, anyways, uh, you know, we've known each other that long. You know, we've had all these experiences. So like I said, it's difficult to let him go. But I know it's for the best. You know, he's, he's met the one, uh, which I know, you know, I've, anytime we talk to each other, I know she's the one, because uh, just look on space. So, in that, re in that respect, uh, it's easy letting her go, knowing that it's for you know, the benefit of the game. Uh, but it's still difficult. Go get him a tissue. Uh, you know, and I wrote this in the card, but I'll share it to everyone. Uh, obviously, I'm single. I'm not in a position to give marriage advice. I understand. However, on the outside looking in, which I am on the outside looking in, uh, I will give this advice. Uh, two things. Marriage is 50-50. Uh, it's not just one way. Um, you know, you got to give each other both, obviously, the love and affection. But in, in every aspect, uh, it's 50-50. So, you, you know, one person should have tried harder than the other. I went in that room. My other brother, uh, Jonathan, he is not single, he's married. Regards, anyways, uh, okay. But, so, marriage is 50-50. I already said that. Uh, the second thing, um, remember, obviously it's one big family now. 
Okay, but this is like five minutes. Checking out all my space and my family. Just remember there is two families. Don't forget that. You know, I'm always here for you. Both of you. Obviously, 26 years. I'm not going to break off like that. So, but, um, yeah, so you, you know I love you. I don't have to say it. Uh, you know I'm always going to be there for you. I don't have to say that. Um, you know. Right. Uh, that's my advice. Um, and, you know, uh, I forgot to even, because a lot of people ask me, are you nervous? I'm not nervous. I'm not nervous. Uh, because, because I wrote down my speech. I didn't know. Oh, sorry. I wrote down my speech. He talks but, loud enough. He's like me. He talks loud enough. He doesn't even need a microphone. <laughs> it is what it is. So, yeah. So, I love you guys. Um, I'm always going to be here. Uh, regardless of my single or taken. Uh, <laughs> but, uh, I'm not kidding. I'm kidding. So, I've been doing this a while. I, you know, 26 years. I'm but, um, you know, so, I can keep going on. But people are probably going to do other things like dance and drink. Uh, and so, that's fine. Um, I just want to walk up to him with my camera and just see what happens. And then just walk away. Oh, lastly. Uh, Joel is the nicest guy. Uh, so, and that's why I want to emphasize too, besides marriage advice. And I love you guys. But I, I can't tell you, Joel is a genuine dude, okay? So, I say that. He is the nicest guy that I've ever met. Uh, clearly. So, okay. And, uh, and then toast to you guys. So, Ladies and gentlemen, this is the team's over.